How old are you going to be this year? 91. Oh, 91. Wow. I, I call you the ninth grader. The 22nd of this month. Oh, is that right? Oh, happy birthday coming up. Yep. Hi, Marianne. How are you? Okay. Good, good. <laughs> Marianne came in today. Just she getting had, older. Yeah, getting older. You have a little pain right here, huh? Yeah, getting older tender. is hard work. Yeah, yeah, it is, huh? How about this one? Pretty painful? Pretty yeah. tender, huh? You may have a little opening here, so we need to clean like that I say, out. I, I can tell there's something wrong there, but I can't see you it. You can't so. see very well, huh? So and then some calluses here, and then we're going to clean out the nails as well. Okay. Let's see. I'm a little concerned about this uh, toe here, so I'm going to clean this That's out a little bit. That's the only thing that concerns me, so. Yeah. When was it uh, bothering you? No, the, when did it start bothering you, this one? Actually, if I'd have had a, a ride, my grandson that gives me rides has been working overtime. You'd have been I'd come in a month ago. But oh, yeah, really? Oh, it's been like a month? since you've It's had been this. about a month. Yeah. Four or five weeks it's been bothering me. Yeah. You have a little opening right here. So, you have this toe that's lower than the other toes, and so it's got a lot of pressure on that toe. Just want to make sure that... Have you been soaking it at all? An Epsom salt or something? I, I, I did until I ran out of Epsom salts a couple of weeks ago. And oh, I is that right? Okay. Haven't been shopping to get any more, so... <laughs> yeah, I think you need to start soaking this uh, one. Actually, he's going to take me shopping Thursday, so... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, tomorrow, huh? Tomorrow yeah. you're going to go? Okay. Yeah, actually it's not infected or anything, but you have a little scab over this, and uh, you got a little opening right here, okay? Like an ulcer. But from, from what I could feel, it feels like the nail, it grows. Yeah, this nail on top, yeah, so I need to clean that out as well. But this toe is kind of further lower than the other toes, and then it's got... Maybe I'd it. hit it more when I was a kid or something. Oh, no, no. <laughs> you, have, you have like hammer toes and other issues. <laughs> so you can see that there's a little opening right here. So I think I need to I need to see you a little bit more often until you close this wound, okay? So I have to take the pressure off this area, so uh, I'm going to give you something to lift up this toe a little. And that'll take the pressure off as well, okay? Okay. And then you're going to start soaking it and putting some antibiotic on it and to get this all cleaned up, okay? So as you can see, there's a little opening right here. Goodness. Is that hurting? Oh, I can feel it. You can feel it? Not terrible? You know. <laughs> yeah, this is a, definitely an ulcer right if here. If I jerk every once in a while, because it hurts a little more. Yeah, so far you're not, you're not jerking, you're not moving. So you're doing okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's not infected or anything, but we want to close this as soon as we can, okay? <laughs> and then let me clean up this little cows here, and then over here as well so it's hard without the transportation huh well i do think so yeah you haven't been uh, driving for how long now well my grand my grandson where he works they've been people often sick and he's been working double shifts and oh is that right oh yeah all sorts of things so yeah a lot of people have been working hard a lot of people still not working i don't know what what's yeah. going on but so a lot of people end up working more and covering for them and everything else. You have some calluses here and I don't think this is open, but we want to make sure it's not going to open. Because your skin's so thin down here. When I could drive, you know, it was no problem. I'd just take myself wherever I wanted to go. Yeah. Otherwise, your health is okay. Your oh yeah, yeah. Other than your eyes, like and... the doctor said, I've got a good immune system. I stay pretty healthy. But uh, oh, okay, that's good. When you can't hear and you can't see and you 
without your false teeth, you can't chew. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's called aging, huh? All, yeah. the, all the peripheral parts are falling apart. Yeah. Is that hurting right here? Not hurting. Not, not I really? can feel okay. it, but okay. I can't say it hurts. Yeah. You have a... You have a, like a deep-seated corn over here as well. When I could see, I would dig those things out. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's hard to... My fingernails were pretty good. <laughs> yeah. You know. My problem is that I'm afraid, since I can't see, I might pull on something that's... Yeah, you shouldn't be doing it anyway. No. So it's kind of hard for you to do it. You have a little corn over here as well. It's a little bit on the deep side. But if it's not painful, I'm not going to burn it off or anything because it's not, it's not painful. If it is, then I'll, I have to burn this corn or here. Dead skin there or something. Yeah, but it's got it's got a deep seated like a corn in there. Yeah. Yeah, right here. But it's not painful, so we'll leave it alone on that. A little else here as well, and then we'll take care of your nails and then. I'll give you instructions how to soak it. Uh, you, have, you know how to soak it in Epsom salt, both feet? I, I, when I can, I usually was using the Epsom salts two or three nights a week. But uh -huh. Get in hot water and Epsom salts and let them sit for 15 or 20 minutes. But... Yeah. So you know the drill. You know what to do. Yeah. Yeah. So you got this nail that's kind of growing thick here too which is not helping that little ulcer there. And I'm gonna give you a little pad over here. Oh, is that sorry? <laughs> no problem. A little tender, huh? Yeah, sorry. That area. You know, you, my age, you expect a little pain in life. You really? I know, you're, you're, you're pretty tough though. You've been through a lot, <laughs> right? Uh, the key does, you know, you're still alive. Yes, yes. So, how, how, young, how young are you gonna be this year? How old are you going to be this year? 91. Oh, 91. Wow. I, I call you the ninth grader. The 22nd of this month. Oh, is that right? Oh, happy birthday coming up. Yep. That's next week, isn't it? Yep. Wow. That's 91? 91. Wow. Congratulations. Not a lot of us make it to 90s, huh? Right? Very few of Actually, us. I come from, I guess, pretty good stock because all but one of my four grandparents made it into the 90s. Oh, is that right? Oh, wow, yeah. The other one was about 69 or 70, something like that. Yeah. My mom and dad, mom was 89. 89? And dad was 93. Oh, is that right? Okay. So you had, you had good genes. Yeah. That's, that's a, quite an accomplishment. Only problem is I've outlived all four of my kids. Oh, I know, I know, you told me. So sorry to hear. But you're still here for some reason, right? But I've got 15 grandkids that are all healthy, so... Oh, that's good, that's good. And then your grandson is the one that brings you here? One of my grandsons, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I just had, on the 18th of March, mm -hmm. the eighth great, great... Friends. Is that right? Yeah. Wow. How do you remember all of them? I got 36 great grandsons. Is that so right? Eight great greats. Wow. You've done well. It's like a little tribe, right? <laughs> yeah. It's like a whole clan. Of course, I don't know very many of them. They're scattered all over the world. Yeah, yeah. I know you told me. They're all over. Oh, only, oh, that one's sore, huh? So I'm going to give you instruction to soak it in Epsom salt. Okay. We're going to put some antibiotics. We're going to take some pressure off the area. I'm going to see you in a couple of weeks to see how that uh, that's healing, okay? Okay. Okay. Very good. But sorry you couldn't come see me about a month ago. That's well, when you needed to see like me. I said, I I don't do much of anything. So. <laughs> yeah. So that one's okay. Now that one's bleeding a little. So we're going to put some antibiotic cream on it and wrap it up, okay? Very good.
I'm gonna see you in a couple of weeks, okay? Okay. After, make sure that this is all closed up nicely before I, uh, we go back to our normal routine. Okay, Marianne, thank you for allowing us to film you today. <laughs> okay, we'll see you in a couple of weeks, okay? Okay. Okay, very good.